Exposure to sunlight offers unique benefits to our health, well beyond those provided by vitamin D. Sunlight consists of different wavelengths of energy, some of which are able to penetrate the skin to different depths of the body's tissues. Those at shorter wavelengths, such as ultraviolet B, can only penetrate the very surface of the skin, while those at higher wavelengths, such as visible light, are able to penetrate deeper. Think of how you are able to see the light from a flashlight penetrate through to the back of your hand when held against the skin on the palm. You can visually see the energy traveling through the skin, muscles, blood vessels, and tissues of the hand. Infrared radiation can even get into the cells and mitochondria and can get through clothing and bone. Let's dive deeper into how exposure to full-spectrum sunlight initiates various health-promoting reactions in the body and offers incredible health effects that cannot be replaced by any supplement or pill. While ultraviolet B, UVB rays are indeed vital for the production of vitamin D in our skin, they also have a pivotal role in different bodily functions. These span from fortifying bone health, strengthening immune function, to aiding in mood regulation. Exposure of the skin to UVB rays initiates the production of vitamin D. The vitamin D made in the skin can also help protect the skin cells from DNA damage, facilitate DNA repair directly upon any UV damage, help prevent cell death, and protect against melanoma. UVB radiation also promotes the production of serotonin and beta endorphins, chemicals that help with mood enhancement and relaxation, relieve pain, and boost immunity. Serotonin is a neurotransmitter involved not only in mood, but also in cognition, regulation of feeding behavior, anxiety, aggression, pain, sexual activity, and sleep. Ultraviolet A, UVA rays penetrate the skin more deeply and stimulate the production of nitric oxide, which helps regulate blood pressure, improves cardiovascular health, and plays a key role in immunity, also having anti-cancer effects. Exposure to UVA and UVB can also have a regulatory effect on the microbiome of both the skin and the gut, with UVB light having a beneficial impact on the diversity and abundance of the bacteria species of the gut microbiome, and both UVB and UVA benefiting the skin microbiome. Studies have even shown that several molecules produced by these beneficial bacteria on the skin can help protect the skin from UV damage. Visible light, particularly blue light, plays a role in regulating our circadian rhythm and sleep-wake cycle. Blue light found in daytime sunlight helps increase nighttime melatonin levels to promote sleep, which can improve overall health, alertness, and cognitive function. Red and near-infrared light, which we feel as heat, can penetrate even deeper into the body and has been shown to provide benefits that include improved tissue function, wound healing, anti-inflammatory effects, and improved energy metabolism. Far-infrared radiation is at the far end of the solar spectrum, opposite of UVB, with the longest wavelength to reach the Earth's surface. Studies suggest that the cardiovascular system especially may benefit from far-infrared exposure, with other reported effects such as blood pressure regulation, improved depressive symptoms, endothelial function, microcirculation, and the formation of new blood vessels. By understanding how each wavelength from sunlight affects our health, we are better equipped to make informed decisions about sun exposure to optimize our well-being. Having learned about the various impacts of sunlight on our health, it's crucial to balance these benefits with safe sun exposure practice. The amount of sun exposure you need largely depends on your skin type. For instance, fair-skinned individuals may need less sun exposure than those with darker skin tones. Regardless of your skin type, it's absolutely essential to avoid sunburn. Sunburn not only hurts, but it also damages your skin and increases your risk of skin cancer. Remember, the key is to enjoy the sun safely and in moderation. By understanding the effects of different wavelengths of sunlight and taking appropriate precautions, you can optimize your health while minimizing risks. Learn more at grassrootshealth.net slash sunshine, where you can also measure your vitamin D level at home when you join the Vitamin D Action Project.